the gold now giving the signals last week for the gold it was really really hard uh, and difficult job to do because as I mentioned the dollar and the gold was really affected badly about the potential news about the sorry about the news of a potential war between USA and China <laughs> China about uh, sorry USA and Iran um, thankfully these news are over no more news about any potential war and therefore now uh, the game is back and I think the gold is now going to continue rising more up uh, let's see what happened right here so I was expecting for the gold to actually reverse on this support level however uh, the dollar got some strength last week and therefore the gold also fall down uh, we can see that the, the gold has reversed on the support level so we have here a support number one and the gold has reversed exactly on this level of support number two now I just want to see why did the gold reverse on this level instead of this level that is gonna be an interesting uh, experiment so let's check out together what happened what was the reason the gold reversed on this support level uh, the answer should be if we look at the past let's go in the past and see any strength uh, or strong support level right here uh, I believe there is nothing maybe it, it was really a long time since the gold was yeah look, let's look at the left and we can see that there is your answer uh, the gold has a very strong support level right here and if you guys remember from my videos what I'm saying um, the strongest level or the level you want to follow when you see a bearish breakout candle you need to look at the nearest wick here and uh, then the closest uh, wick or tail to the breakout candle that is most likely where the reversal is gonna occur and that is exactly what happened to be honest with you frankly I did not think this is gonna happen because of the news about uh, that war and therefore I really thought the gold is gonna continue rising up immediately without going down to that level so anyway what happened happened and the gold is rising more up now the question is where should we start buying the currency because of the current the gold uh, because obviously the gold is going up um, let me just uh, tell you something here uh, the gold will reverse most likely the gold is gonna reverse and go down a little bit before we can start again buying the gold and close our trade right on the level of this resistance however it's really important to find the level where we can expect for the gold to reverse uh, analyzing the gold is gonna take some time because I really need to be sure I cannot afford to have another uh, bad day with the gold so let's see what will gonna happen now uh, let's go back to the, back to the daily candles and let's see from trend lines views what is gonna happen so since I'm planning to uh, I want to see what will gonna happen with the sell I need to draw a resistance trend line that is my resistance trend line like that like that perfect it is also very valid as a support and if we see it as a resistance let me just go to the back to the four hour chart uh, we can see that exactly this is the level like that it, it reverse exactly right on it perfect fantastic the reversal happened exactly uh, following that trend line however I have to mention that the reversal is gonna happen immediately for the gold uh, please don't sell the gold at all I don't think it's gonna be smart idea at all to short the gold um, I'm expecting for it to reverse right on the support level right here exactly here uh, because we have here a strong support level and the pair seems to be going to fall down and let, if you zoom in actually check it out if we zoom in we can see the support level here and it was also a resistance therefore I believe the gold is gonna go down retesting this previous resistance and then it's gonna continue its uh, momentum to go more up uh, let me just confirm if this level was actually acting as a strong support and resistance let me get rid of the trend line let's go in the past of course we can see clearly that we had here the previous resistance it is actually where the reversal happened we just need to be sure that this is the right level to start 
uh, buying the gold look at the past we can see look at that perfect look at check it out check it out I wanted to see that let me just uh, show you I'm going back in the past let me just show you what I saw here right now like look at look at that take a look this is the bearish breakout candle and this is the closest wick or tail to this breakout candle therefore we can expect for the reversal to happen exactly right on this level fantastic it is nice to see that uh, what I'm saying is sometimes valid <laughs> nice okay so again uh, as I mentioned we need to use the trend lines now to find the buy signal and let me draw it on a support level just one second let me just find the right level to draw my uh, support trend line uh, if I'm not mistaken it's gonna be like that and drag it all the way like that uh, it's not gonna be like that honestly let me just uh, find a support trend line a, a, a good support you know what I can even use it on a resistance level it's the same just like that even the resistance has been respected here right here and right here and perfectly the same exactly right here yeah I'm I believe again I will stick to my word that this level is gonna be good for buying the gold and it seems to be better level actually um let me just I, I just want to be if I just want to give a, a safe signal for everyone uh, maybe it's a gold actually might fall down a little bit for the support level but I don't think it's gonna go below this level at all if the gold is gonna enter this support zone it's gonna definitely it's definitely gonna reverse and we can see that we had here a support number one and the market is gonna create support number two therefore it's gonna continue going more up so all in all the gold is flying up however it is a game about where should we start buying the gold always I'm telling you and advising everyone to use a small lot size be extra careful when you are buying the gold it's really sensitive uh, using big lots can wipe your account easily because the gold movement is very strong and a small movement can cost you a lot of pips so let me just uh, write down the levels for you gold is good for the buy on the level 1552.01 expect for it to fall down to 1446.79 but definitely that is gonna be the best level at all to start buying the gold and close your trade close your trade once the market hit this previous uh, resistance right here actually it's gonna continue flying more up until this level however I just want everyone to be safe and I want to give a realistic uh, signal therefore I will give you the take profit level take profit to be on the level 1578.74 that should be more realistic and the safe level for uh, closing the trade with the profit if I'm not mistaken about yes 266 pips of profit if anything goes wrong if the signal didn't go well I will update you guys in another uh, midweek uh, video even before the midweek video I can't do it on even Tuesday or Monday if uh, we have to see what will gonna happen with the gold um, I will update you with another video so anyway uh, that is my expectation for the gold and I hope this will be a profitable week for everyone and I would like to thank you for watching